Now you can hear it. <laughs> okay, hold on. We'll start that one again. <laughs> All right, just a second here. We are so excited to be joined by former pitcher for the Toronto Blue Jays and the Anaheim Angels, Kelvin Escobar. Welcome to the walk-off, man. Thanks so much for taking the time. Look, technical difficulties happen. Technology rarely works when it's supposed to. All the love for Calvum here. And of course, we're going to get things sorted out and have a proper conversation at a later date. But we just wanted to use this opportunity, give a little peek behind the curtains at some of the stuff most of you never get to see. And if you enjoy this kind of stuff, consider supporting us on Patreon. Every interview we do goes up on Patreon, unedited, with all the outtakes left in, and that informal, casual conversation. Patreon.com slash The Walk Off Podcast. Hello, hello. Can you hear us okay? You're oh, on mute we don't for hear, us. We can't yeah. hear you yet. We don't hear you, so your audio is muted probably. <laughs> No, we, we don't hear you. Oh, there we go. Now it's connecting. There, now I think we got your audio. Can you hear me now? Now yeah, we, we can you. hear you. There we go. Oh, we very you. good. <laughs> hey, Calvin, thanks so much for joining us, man. This is exciting. Hey, thank you, guys, man. Thank you for having me. Yeah. Uh, do you have a hard out? We normally go about 30 minutes, 45 minutes, but we don't want to keep you longer than you have. So we can do no, whatever. I, I think I'm okay with that. You're okay with that? Amazing. Yeah, okay with that. Yeah. All right. So I'm Scott. I'm who you've been messaging with on Instagram. This is Adam, my co-host. Um, so we have some listener questions for you, which we'll get to at the end. And uh, I'll just kind of lead things off the top here. Okay. Sounds good. Awesome. Okay. Uh, I'll do a three, two, one countdown. Scott will jump in with the intro and we'll just get right to it. So uh, three, two, one, and we're rolling. Now you can <laughs> okay. Hold on. We'll start that one again. <laughs> All right. Just a second. here. Okay. Three, two, one, and we're rolling. We are so excited to be joined by former pitcher for the Toronto Blue Jays and the Anaheim Angels, Kelvin Escobar. Welcome to the walk-off, man. Thanks so much for taking the time. <laughs> All right. We got you back here, man. Oh, I think your sound's muted again. There you go. No, we can't hear you. No, still no sound. No. <laughs> Sorry, man. <laughs> mm. <laughs> there we go. Oh, no. no. Huh. Do you want to try closing the app, then turning your AirPods in, and then just rejoin? Yeah, okay. Oh, he's here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. That was Kelvin Escobar, everybody. <laughs> and his wife for one second. Uh, that was so funny. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All good. Old guys and their technology, hey? Mm-hmm. I don't know if you saw his Instagram page or not, but he's ripped, dude. Oh, is like, it? Oh, he yeah, is a machine. Out. Yeah. Uh, okay. Checking this out now. Is he the only Kelvin in the world, by the way? <laughs> I don't know. I'm going to start calling Kevin Biggio Kelvin Biggio. <laughs> I'm going to do it real subtle and see if anyone picks up on it. Uh, we had that one comment on the YouTube videos that described him as Kevin Biggio, and I just love yeah. that. Yeah. So maybe I'll maybe I'll make a transition this year. I'll start calling him Kevin. Holy smokes, is he ever 
Jesus. Right? Whoa, dude. How old like, is uh, he? Yeah. <laughs> That's what I said. I'm he like, looks like he's 22, holy, man. Like, I'm like, tell me he can't throw 95. <laughs> wow. All right. Well, that's unfair. Damn, dude. Mm -hmm. I got to use that AI filter that Joel sent us there. Get myself some pictures like this. Yeah. <laughs> Joel was stressing last night, eh? Yeah. Oh. It was making me stress a little too. I was just like, oh my God. Like it's going to be, it's really, I mean this, man. It is going to open up the door to so many hacks to just like. Well, it's, I haven't tried it yet, but I am curious what it's sense of humor is like. So probably amazing. That Bob Seeger baseball song that I got it to write was pretty decent though, eh? Yeah, I know. I was like, we should get, we should get Drew to yeah. write this for us. Yeah. Like just sing it. <laughs> we should just do it. Um, he's not back. eh? no. Well, this is going to be one of the most disappointing Patreon early releases we ever do at this point. Uh, you see the comment on yesterday's Patreon video where they're like, my favorite part is when Adam jumped into his heart when the dog barks <laughs> oh man it was just a oh. freaking amazon driver dropping off something for my wife but of course yeah you're like great i was as soon as i came back and sat down i was like i wonder what stupid face i made in the middle of that like how panicked did i i must yeah. have just looked like the police were raiding my house it was you know, so that, funny that like oh my god <laughs> what am it I was so do? funny Excuse yeah it was language. so funny oh man Okay, well, he had it. <laughs> we yeah, had I don't know. It. I don't know. How are you gonna pass? How am I gonna pass? Like to the great beyond? When you go, not like how are you gonna die? But what? What do you want done to your corpse afterwards? You can get buried. You can get cremated. Oh yeah, cremate that shit. Yeah, me too. Me too. I mean, we take up and consume enough space and stuff on the planet when we're alive. I do not need to take up space while I'm dead. Like, what the are you going to are you going to be like in an urn on your grandchildren's mantle? Is that my or you my only re my only request will be do not sprinkle my ashes. You keep them every single last ash together. Pass them on. Yeah. OK. I well, want it in a plastic sure. bag. I want it in a plastic bag. And I want it hanging from the top of the Christmas tree every year. <laughs> nice. Nice. That's our Christmas angel. I wonder if his wife's helping him right now. Probably. Probably. I was like, uh, we were talking with, what's his face there from Blue Jays UK? We should talk to him again soon. He was a good guy. Steve. Yeah, Steve, he was. Yeah, thank you. And he was talking about when he interviewed uh, Blair and Barker. And how Hazel was helping Barker get the yeah. Zoom set up, right? So, yeah, that Chad GPT, though, pretty wild with what it's able to do. I don't know if you went on and dabbled with it at all yourself. I didn't. I didn't. It's just, I did learn one limitation of it is the data that it's pulling from right now stops at 2021. Like that's why it was struggling with my Bobachette questions about like the valuation and stuff. It's basing right. on who he was in 2020 right okay right so still like fresh rookie you know but yeah it, it is definitely clarified because i was asking him like what are some talking points that i should do for my blue jays podcast tomorrow like give me six talking points for tomorrow's episode i was just hopefully seeing if i could just replace you entirely yeah um nope but, can't be done but, <laughs> unfortunately it was like ah sorry i'd love to help but uh my data set cannot pull from anything after 2021 so i'm no help right now it's like oh okay it's all good buddy and then we just talked hung out for a bit it was kind of creepy got to know each other me and the ai but i mean it's right around the corner yeah it is around the corner so um i was listening to you ever watch mad tv yeah uh what's the big guy's name for mad tv will sasso will sasso he has a podcast that is entirely directed by AI. I don't know if you've heard of this. I haven't. 
he was on the Lex Friedman podcast. I like Lex Friedman because he has interesting guests and he's kind of a super genius. But he had Will Sasso on and they were talking about his podcast. So Will Sasso and whoever his co-host are, they just have, he said they had to like give over the reins to this company. So this company had this idea for this podcast, but it's basically like they got full access to Will and his co-hosts, like browsing history and emails and all this stuff. And then this AI bot formulates a weekly or daily, I don't know. I've never actually listened to the podcast, but like a outline for the show based on the two of them and like talking points and then skits, amazing skits is it funny do. it sounds like it is like i don't know yeah. I, again i haven't actually checked out the podcast but just the way he's describing it and he's like yeah and then the ai will just tell me like it'll just like write out a script for a skit that they're gonna just do in the middle of their podcast and it's like okay mm-hmm. you're gonna do a batman versus whatever but batman is played by Garth Brooks and the Joker is played by Danny DeVito. Okay. And then here's the impressions and then they just have to just do it. And they just, you know, cause they're like improv specialists. So they can do that. Yeah. But uh, he's like, yeah, he's like, we just get the weirdest shit to talk about that we would never have come up with on our own. But he's like, I don't know, just. It's yeah. Where, it's where the future is going. It's kind of crazy. Kind of crazy. That's so wild. Should I message him like, or just leave him alone right now? Um, let's give it another five and then maybe we could just message him and be like, Hey, we are going to be running late for time at this point. Can we reschedule? Yeah. I don't know. Okay. What do you think? Yeah, I kind of, I, I kind of just want to let him off the hook. Like, yeah, for sure he'll get it sorted out and we'll do it eventually. But also, I don't want, I don't want to eventually get to the point where we do a podcast and he's mentally exhausted from figuring yeah. out technology for the last twenty five minutes and he's just like in a bad mood. Yeah, you know what I mean. Plus, we have enough already for a good clip. Yeah. <laughs> oh man. I know you don't want to have to wait till February and I don't really want to either, but Mm -hmm. we do have enough for a clip where we can just like put out a funny clip, like teaser trailer kind of thing. Right. Like, but Haggy D got back to me and he's a hundred percent in for tomorrow. So nice. I mean, Calvin also was supposedly a hundred percent here, but well, he showed up. Yeah, he did. Like he, yeah. Showed up, had his big gulp, ready to go. Yeah. I feel bad now. (laughs) It's not our fault. Like, (laughs) No, not at all. And honestly, if it was, I'd be like, hey, let me send a link. But he got it in. So, like, it's not that. It's his settings on Zoom. Yeah, I don't know. What was going weird? I don't know. There's a scene in the office. I think they're doing CPR training. And it's Kevin's turn to train on the chest compressions. Mm -hmm. And he does like six compressions and then he's exhausted. And he's just like, call it. Like he's dead body (laughs) compressions for like two seconds. (laughs) I just have a, in my mind, a a vision of that clip playing right now. I'm calling it. It's done. Let's just move on. We'll try Calvin again tomorrow or another day. And then I just wrote, hey, Calvin, if it's easier for you to reschedule, we can do that. We just really appreciate you taking the time. Sorry about the technical difficulties. Sounds good. I think I think we wrap it up here and I put out this full episode on the main channel. And we just see what happens. <laughs> this is just Scott and Adam and a little bit of Calvin. And that's the new format. <laughs> Uh, get your questions in by the way if you're watching this if this episode ever did see the light of day uh, uh, <laughs> get your questions in when we do get kelvin back uh yeah yeah thanks for watching i don't know should we how let's much call it gonna wait you gonna call it okay ah uh, okay. should we wait 10 more minutes sure but we got to keep talking then we got to fill time here scott because 
Well, I, I don't, out. yeah, right. I don't, I don't want to, um, maybe we do just call it. I, I haven't done anything for Adam Mako yet. And I do need to, uh, get that together, but how, how about this? Hey, Adam Mako, Adam Mac, that's pretty close. Yeah. And, and we'll then we'll start we just, with that. And then we just see what happens. We'll start with that. Okay. Yeah. God like damn it. The, we were like, we were literally talking to him. Like we were going into the intro. <laughs> yeah, I know. I'm what sure. happened? Life happens, my friend. Oh, now I've lost you, Scott. No, you're back. There you go. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I no, don't know. I'm back here. Yeah. I don't know, man. Um, this is it's the life. Right. Hey. This isn't the life we chose. This life chose us. Okay. This is the life of being a world class broadcaster. Okay. Yeah. Welcome to the party. Yeah. This is it, my friend. We've made it. <laughs> this is as good as it gets. Uh, yeah. Wow. This is. I think it's done. I think it's done. Oh, uh, I mean, don't say it in like a pessimistic our relationship with Kelvin is over. He'll be back. Yeah. Right? He yeah. probably just went to work out quickly, get a pump on. Yeah. What's hilarious is like, imagine we just never hear from him again. He just like, he's like, I don't need to deal with this. He's gone like a fart in the wind. Just, yeah. Just like you know. we have, but we have video proof that he, he did, a, he did show up. <laughs> yes. yes, he did show up. So there you go. All right. Well, I think I am going to release this episode. Cause why not? Uh, not online though are you where else are we gonna release it into the wild <laughs> yeah let it's it like go a... <laughs> okay Pikachu, you're free i have ex- i have different pokemon that are better than you um <laughs> why not i meant patreon just 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 patreon just patreon yeah maybe all right <laughs> maybe i'll put the full thing on patreon and then i'll just put a, a quick teaser out that like yeah. hey Things went kind of haywire today. Yeah. Catch it on Patreon if you want to see. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. There you go. Uh, Scott wants to be cremated. Uh, do not scatter his ashes. I want to be cremated. And, uh, you know, hey, that little dumpster that I showed you a few episodes ago, that miniature yeah. metal dumpster, that's what I want for my urn. Yes. I want to be put in a little black mini garbage bag and then placed inside that dumpster. And then that is... Sure, that dumpster is too expensive as a garbage can. But, but as, as a, a urn? Cheap as, cheap as borscht, buddy. Just there you go. The <laughs> root vegetable go. of urns. <laughs> All, right. All right, Scott. Good talking to you. We'll reconvene uh, a couple hours for Adam Mako.